What's going on, you guys? So, I just want to talk to you guys. I just want to have a, a real conversation. Um, and this is just all about living in your truth. Um, I know a lot of people don't like the LGBTQ plus community. A lot of people don't really understand um, individuals that identify in that community. But at the same time, I don't think you should hide who you are because of those people. There are always going to be somebody, there's always going to be somebody that doesn't like who you are even if you weren't in that community they still wouldn't like you for something whether it's the way you look your skin complexion your eye color your hair the way you walk who who knows people will find something that they don't like no matter what it is if they really just don't want to like you um and i feel like if the people that are around you can't love you for who you are, then they simply just don't need to be around. Like, you don't need to be around those people because they're, they're negative, for one. And they're worried about you. They need to be worried about themselves. Like, I understand those people that... um have like the religious families and stuff like that. I understand that um, you don't want to kind of distance your, you don't want to be distanced from your family, um, especially if you're really, really, really close with your family, your mom, your dad, and all those people, um, and you're afraid that they're going to judge you. Um, chances are they're already judging you. Most of the time, they're already judging you. Most of the time, they already know that you are living a certain way. They're just not going to bring it up because they're hoping that it's just something that you're doing for right now and then you'll get over it. Um, me, myself, I went through... I went through not telling my family for the longest and then I just finally realized like if they really truly love me then they won't make me feel any kind of way for what I like or who I love or whatever they won't make me feel in a way they won't pass judgment on me um and that's the way I feel that I probably feel stronger about that now than I do when I was hiding it. Like, because if anybody that is around can't love the person that I'm with or can't understand that I'm with this person because this is what I like or what I love or who I am, then that means they don't need to be in my circle. Like, don't come around me and be fake. Like, do not be fake towards me. Do not try to tell me that you're happy for me and you're not. Like, that is like a pet peeve of mine. Don't be, don't be fake. Do not try to tell me that you're okay with something and you're not. Because the things that you do that tell me that you're not is going to show me that you just lie. Like, don't, don't lie to me. I don't like liars. Um, if somebody is afraid to show them true, to show their true self, that, that means they probably haven't 
found who they really are, who they truly and really are. Um, it took me a while to kind of find who I am or who I wanted to be. Um, I can truly say today, like at two twelve, I know who I am. I know who I am. I don't put I don't put a label on me, um, and that's just because that's putting myself in a box, and I'm not gonna put myself in a box for nobody, because I've been put in a box all my life. So I refuse to put myself in a box. Um, but you have to live your truth. Because if you live if you're not living your truth, that means you're literally miserable all the time. You are constantly thinking about what everybody else is thinking about you and not actually thinking about what you think of yourself. What do you think what what do you think of yourself? Like today, what do I think of myself? I think that I have flaws. I think that I am lovable. I might have a very standoff demeanor. Stand standoffish. I can't even say it. Standoffish demeanor. My face might tell you to don't talk to me. But once you get to know me, you're going to understand that I'm a very lovable person. Uh, I don't have any ill will against nobody. I don't wish harm against anybody. I am a very nice individual. But people automatically look at the outside of my face because I have I have an RBF. They automatically think, oh, she's mean. It's not it's not that I'm mean, I just this is just my face. Like, what what are you gonna do? But just live just live your truth like stop trying to be somebody else for somebody or everybody stop worrying about what the world thinks stop worrying about if i walk into the mall holding another female's hand or another male's hand that somebody's gonna look at me weird like okay they gonna look at you weird if you walk in the mall by yourself Cause I've seen it happen. I walked in the mall by myself and people just like, and I'm looking at them like, Hey, you got an issue? Like, what is the problem? Like they going they gonna find a way to judge. So it don't matter who you walk in the mall holding hands with. They gonna judge you anyway. You can walk in the mall holding somebody that's imaginary. Like they still gonna judge. Like it don't matter. So, don't try to live your life for what people think because you just not you ain't gonna ever be happy because people change their perception about everything every five ten minutes like they don't they don't know so i just say be who you want to be live in your truth live for you and not anybody else because once those people see how great you are and the greatness that you're going to, to accomplish, they're going to want to come around. And for me, if those people come back around, I'm going to look at them like, where were you when I wasn't where I am now? Just because you see I am doing something or I can benefit you, then you want to come around. No, boo. It don't work like that. Don't be around me just because I can do something for you because I'm not with it. So, and that goes for anybody. That goes for family. That goes for friends. That goes for anybody. If my family disowned me and then I turned out to be a damn billionaire and then they wanted to come around, I'm going to look at them like, where were you when I wasn't a billionaire? I was still the same person. I still liked girls then. I still like girls now. So what's the difference? Oh, the difference is I got money now. Is that what it is? Well, you ain't getting none. Like, don't do that.
I don't like those people. Those individuals can step on out of my life. So that's all I just wanted to say. I just want to have this brief little conversation. To anybody that needed to hear this, um, be yourself. Please don't live for anybody. And I'm going to say that again. Be yourself. Do not live for anybody. Do not care what people think about you. Because they're going to judge you either way it go. Whether you're straight, gay, bi, trans, pan. It don't really matter. They're going to judge you. So, live for you. Be happy. Live in your own skin. Just be truthful to yourself. And make sure if you're not subscribed, go ahead to make sure and subscribe to my channel. Click that bell down below. Also put a like on this video. And I will talk to you guys later. If you don't know, now you know. Bye!